Hey everyone, I'm here on Guild Wars 2. A couple of my friends who played Lotro have now also been playing or continue to play Guild Wars 2, so I've decided basically to try in Guild Wars 2. And I'm actually enjoying it. So I'm gonna do a I'm gonna start doing a let's play on Guild Wars 2. I'm obviously gonna short gonna choose the short character because I don't know why, but I'm just lean towards the cute but badass ones so obviously hobbits but they're not called hobbits here they're called asuras don't let this appearance fool you that's just basically a silhouette we're gonna press next i'm gonna you i already have a female warrior um but i'm gonna choose a male this time i'm gonna press next and i want it to be an elementalist by the way, that face can be changed because they can look cuter. Or believe me, they will look cuter than that. But they do look like gremlins if you want them to. Slash um, yordles. Okay, so I want to be an elementalist. The thing I don't like about this is you really can't see their feet properly at all. Which is lame -o. I don't want them to be tall, of course. So that's going to be the physique. They're very reptilian. I don't like that color. I'm just going to go dark. I think the dark one looks probably the most awesome one and then skin markings are basically these little markings on their bodies there is more customizations here I'm gonna go with this one because it looks cute and the ears I want it to be oh see look at their cute ears wow this is pretty awesome the Basically my character is already nearly done just by that default button. Look how cute he is already. Brow well for me it's cute so whatever. So eye color is already green. I want it to be I like this white one. Okay, so white. Oh okay, that's fine. Looks cute. Anyway, so now I'm gonna go to armor dies. See this is the problem I don't like about this. Is you can't see their feet. You can change it to nighttime so you can see the colors better. And apparently you can skip to the very end, which I'm not going to because I'm not. Now I'm going to choose a name. So this will be called Candy Boo. So here I am. You're going to get tutorials like Lotro. And yes, I will refer Lotro a lot. Here I am. And see these little green little stars is basically your book quest. So this guy's already getting punched. I don't know why. Cool, that then. So we're just gonna. This is basically the intro. We're gonna talk to Rob. Close this. That's Rob. Peacemaker, do they help? Alright, blah blah blah. We're gonna go to the next point. So the world pretty looks pretty cool. I'm gonna do a like, fast swerve thing. Yeah, there's just lots of different things besides questing in this game. So I'm basically going to go to the portal. I'm going to actually increase the options to the sound. So, sorry but if you didn't hear the sound, but yeah. Here's my character, Candy Boo, and this can be zoomed in, obviously. Oh, I'm a cute hobbit. Okay, so now here we go, and that's the intro. That was the intro to the for this race. It was faster because I wanted to be faster. Oh, we're still in the book. Look, Actually, Snaff's footnote has joined our little party, and she brought friends. Teo, oh, for so a this is the book. So if you want to read all the story, you can. You don't have to, feelings. but it's true. Blah blah blah. I'm not dangerous, but these golems are. Here, let them show you what dangerous really means. Why don't all of you give these folks a proper welcome? Let's attack them. I am Remember, this is the Asura. <laughs> There are humans, like I said, and cat people. And by the way, these letters, you can get rid of them if you want it, in settings. I personally wanted letters above their head because that's what I'm used to in Lotro. So there are bad hobbits too. Doja. So 
we're gonna kill all these um these little bad dudes. Because it's just the intro. I'm gonna pan the camera up. I mean that's pretty awesome. And that's the wormhole I came through through. And that's where I'm supposed to be headed. This is apparently a glass wall, and there's a waterfall back there. This game is free to play, but like most free to play, you probably are limited to some things or some levels. You know, each zone looks different. This zone is apparently futuristic slash. Oh my god, what the fuck? I gotta concentrate. Oh man. I'm gonna kill this giant crap. Oh my god. You're looking a little wobbly. That's scramble for your brain games. I have to watch out for those red circles. Oh shit. I'm shooting them from the back because you know the back is the best to kill people. Oh, there we go, it's dead. Cool. So that was the intro. And now here is the pro- Like, see this? The little icons at the bottom? Those are things you have to do. And if you complete it, you get another reward. What is this? So, I- This is, I guess, I achieved something. My reward is a dagger, because I am a dagger user. And this, as you can see, is 122. So we're gonna accept that. Cool. Look at this other... Whoa, look at this goblin. Oh, there's two of them there. Hilarious. Cute. Aww. Anyways, guys, thanks for... Whoa, what is that? Thanks for watching this episode. Very first episode of um, my Guild Wars 2 Let's Play. And I am here just outside the um, intro. And this is the beginner area. So thanks guys for watching, take care and subscribe and leave a comment and check out my video detail for all the other social media links and stuff. I don't care what my crew will be for this, and I am you'll see.